Welcome to a quick tour of Epson Copy Factory. Epson Copy Factory is a quick and easy way to enlarge printed documents and digital pictures to many standard poster sizes. To use the solution, you'll need to have an Epson scanner or multifunction printer attached to your computer running a 32-bit version of Windows XP, Vista, or 7. Let's take a closer look at the Epson Copy Factory user interface. We have an opportunity to tell the program what type of originals we're starting with whether it be a photographic original or a publication such as a magazine article, a printed document, or a newspaper clipping. Next, we'll tell the program what the paper source is that we're going to be printing to, whether it be a sheet or a roll, and of the rolls, what width it will be. When we choose the width, this defines the print sizes that we can pick from. On a 24-inch roll, I have a number of different standard sizes to print. I can make this a 24 by 36 large poster, or do something smaller like an 18 by 24. Lastly, we choose the type of paper that we're going to have loaded into the printer. In this case, I'm using Epson's Premium Luster Photo Paper. And now we're all set. To make an enlargement, all I need to do is press the large green copy button. But if I want to preview and zoom into a particular selection of the original, I want to click on the preview area, which has this green magnifying glass button. When I do this, the scanner is going to first detect the original by doing a pre-scan. Then, once it understands how large the original is, it will scan the area and create a thumbnail view that I can start editing. And there we go. And there's our preview. Epson Copy Factory automatically selected the area where the image content is, but perhaps I only want to zoom into a small section of that. I can do that by clicking Manual, seeing everything that the scanner saw, and now just zooming into the section I want. I just want this area here. By drawing a box around it, now I just press the green magnifying glass to see a preview of just that area. That looks good to me. And that's it. All I have to do now is press the large green copy button. When I do this, it's going to begin the copy process. It's scanning the original, just that area I zoomed into at very high resolution, to make sure that the 18 by 24 inch print that's going to be coming out is going to look as best as possible. It just takes a moment, and as soon as it's done scanning, it will begin printing right away. This print should be done in just a moment. In addition to making enlargements of printed documents, I can also start with a digital photo original. To do that, I want to click on Open File, pick my photo, and then press Open. I'll need to change my original type from publication over to a photo because, well, it is a photo. The Document Enhancement feature does work for some photos, however, it's geared more towards publications that's going to make text and lines a lot more crisp and clear. My paper source, I don't need to make any changes because it's already correct. But my print size, I want to change that from a 18 by 24 to make two 11 by 18s. In doing this, I'll have a copy for myself and one for my father. That said, I'm ready to go. I just need to press copy. And there you have it, Epson Copy Factory, a quick and easy way to make enlargements of both printed original documents as well as digital pictures.